Hi, George here. And today I'll be showing you how you can download and install maps into Minecraft Java, like this adventure map that I'm playing right here. Okay, the first thing we need to do is to find a new map. And for that, let's go over to Planet Minecraft. Here we are on Planet Minecraft. This is a great place to get all kinds of custom stuff for your Minecraft game. Maps, texture packs, player skins, mod skins, a lot of stuff in here. This is the skin editor that I use when I'm making custom skins for any of my mobs or characters, whatever, right there. We'll be looking at maps. Click on maps. Here we go. This is the maps section. There are lots of different kinds of maps in here. You can get land structure maps, adventure maps like this one right here, huge world maps that we have right over here. Some of these are paid, some of these are free. If there's a green icon like this, this is a free map. If you see a dollar sign over here, this is a paid map. The prices are real low but there's a little cost to some of those. There's a cost to this one right here. Some of these people are just showing off like this one right here. I'm going to choose a map from the best set. Click on best. Here it is. And the one that we'll be downloading today is on page two. Switch over here. Now, some of these maps will require additional plugins to run properly. Some of them require other ways of installing them. We'll just be doing a real basic map on that. And that's just Stranded Island right there. It's a free map. It's been up for 11 years, but still works great. So I'll click on this. This takes you into the page just for this map. You can read more about that right down here. There's also a link here on how to install maps, but this just tells you exactly what I'll be showing you right now. So the first thing is to download the map. Now these normally go over to a cloud storage space. Let's click on this one. This one goes to Mediafire. Metally Planet Minecraft, that's fine. Click on continue. I like Mediafire because they do virus scans right there on their downloads. And if it's been up for a long time, if the map has been up for a long time on Planet Minecraft and there's no problems, then you know it's going to be okay. This is a 30 meg download right there. You can choose your operating system right down here. Mine's in Windows. Now I've already downloaded this. Just click on this and then you choose a download location. Let me show you that real fast here. There it is. There's a download location. I saved mine into a folder I just named pack on my hard drive. And there's the download. Okay, this is go over and take a look at that. Now we're all done with this. We can close this down, close that down. That's just an ad page. We're done with that. Get that out of the way. And we'll bring up that folder. Here it is. The file comes down as a zip file. So you need to unzip this. Easy way is just to right click and use the Windows zip to unzip it. Just choose extract all. And what you get is right over here. Here's the folder extracted. Open this up. And here's a readme text. Take a look at that. See what's in there. This gives you a few challenges and things like that. And here's the folder that you need. Go inside here, here's all the folder structure. Back out again. We need to put this into the game and do that by going back over here and open the launcher up. Make sure you're in the Java edition. Go into installations and then latest release and click on that folder icon right there. That brings up the Minecraft folder and you want to come down to saves, which is right here. I've already saved mine and all you do is just open this up and then take this and drag it and drop it into that folder. Let's see where that is. There we go. Survival Island stranded, so I've already copied that over here. That's all set to go. Get this out of the way. Then play the game. Click on play. Let this load in Minecraft. Now I have a custom screen here. I don't use that scrolling panorama. If you want to learn how I did all this stuff, I'll put links for that stuff in the video description right down below. Go into single player, and in here you're going to be finding that on the list. Now, mine's at the top because it was the last one I played. You may find yours down below here someplace. So you'll see it in your list. Go ahead, play that. This is an older map, but it still works great here inside of Minecraft, as you can see. And there it is. That's all there is to it. Okay, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, and I'll see you next time.